Nue is one of two bosses you'll face at the end of the Kyushu region, and this demon is pretty imposing, but does have some weaknesses. You're going to be up against a lot of lightning attacks, and knowing when and where to expect the strikes is the key to victory. The first and most painful attack comes when Nui starts building up a charge by shaking vigorously. At this point, you should be moving constantly, preferably strafing around the boss, as Nui unleashes four separate strikes that will follow your movements. As long as you keep moving and don't double back, you should be good to start attacking after dodging the last strike. The next big attack comes usually when facing the boss. If you notice Nui get on his hind legs, quickly run a roll to the side as Nui rolls into a ball, careening forward and trailing a long line of lightning strikes behind him. So long as you keep to the sides, you should be fine. Keeping with that in mind, your best method of attacking Nui should come from the sides. Up front, you run the risk of the lightning ball, as well as swipes from his claws, and even a lightning beam that Nui can shoot from his mouth in an arc. From behind, his snake tail can unleash poison, but around the sides, he has nothing to offer other than a slow spin attack that doesn't deal much damage or have much range that you can just dash backwards to avoid. If at range, you also need to watch for a wild leaping strike from Nui, but thankfully this leaves him incredibly vulnerable as Nui crashes to the ground, leaving his belly exposed. This is also why you should stick to the side of the boss for a better chance at hitting his belly. Just be sure to be on top of your key management and disperse all the yokai realms he emits from his lightning strikes. They can pile up quickly. As long as you fight in the right places, Nui should be no problem. For more on how to beat Neo bosses, be sure to check out our wiki guide, and for all else, stay tuned to IGN.